five dollars lighter. Like, how much more lighter can my paycheck get? Oh, well, and, and you and you think Trump is going to be good for the this United fucking States? Trudeau guy, this fucking Trudeau guy. First thing he did, very first thing, very first fucking business, not infrastructure, nothing else. He let twenty five thousand fucking Syrian refugees in. Very first order of business when I, he got I, Yeah, I know. And and no, and the world is applauding him. Trust me, trust me, trust me, you Americans. They're gonna make their way over to America. Oh, I know. They are going I know. to make their way over there. That's and true. And it's gonna be Canada's fault. And you know what? I, I know they will, and I don't want them here. And that's bad for me to say. I do not want them here <laughs> because you can't trust them. Even though I do have a very oh, dear man. Pakistani friend. Oh, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. No, no, no. Hold, hold on, Joe. Hold on, Joe. Let me finish, okay? About, about Canada. As soon as they got off the plane, they handed them a free health card. That's absolutely free health care. Then they then they handed them a free dental voucher uh, worth up to five thousand dollars each. Wow! Awesome, Fox. Listen to me. And I'm walking around a Canadian working taxpayer with teeth like this. I'm my, I'm my doctor. Well, because you you won't take Hold on, shut take up, your... shut up, Joe. Shut up, Joe. Shut up, Joe. Let me finish. Right. Let me finish. I mean, you know what my doctor said? Quit my job on going welfare and I'll have my fucking job. That's what I would, honestly, that's Fox, that's what go. I would that's do for like two months. My, doctor, my doctor's advice to me is quit my job, go on welfare, eight months, I'll have new teeth. No. Fox, I, listen, I listen, this is my job. idea. I tell your, you look, life. talk to Satinum and tell him. Hey, <laughs> We can do this together. Is there any way you can lay me off for as long as it takes? You can get paid fucking now. Tell them when you come back, you're going to have these. Be fraud. Not, you're fraud. going to be more productive. That'd be fraud. But fu no, it wouldn't. He's a lot, look, bosses do it all the time in construction and all that. But AYH, I want to point out something she said before I forget it. AYH said, uh, I shouldn't say this, but I don't trust them. Don't well, you think that I sounds don't. a little bit racist? I don't. Oh, how can well, you call I don't call trust colored people, racist. and I say that out in the open, and you say well, you call me a racist. How can you call anyone racist? Yeah, well, I'm calling you out. You said that because I say, no, hey, you're not I don't calling trust me out. I just person. said it. Look, but I'm saying if, if I say I don't trust colored people, would that be racist? What color are you speaking of? Colored. Any color. I don't know than, what color Any that color is. that's different than my own. I don't know uh, what that could it be Asians, uh, could it be it, Indians, look, could it be has uh, Puerto Indian, Ricans, I don't trust could them. it be blacks? I don't know what color you're speaking of. Well, you seen my skin so color. So when you before. say colored, I think of all different races except for white people. Well, when I say colored, I think of black people. Oh well, then black why don't you say black people? people? Well, I don't think. I, well, I'm saying any color, but still. When I say colored, I think of black people is what I'm saying. Like if I was a third party and I didn't know what was going on, I'd be like, he's talking about black people. Black people think that they're entitled to more than white people. Exactly. No, that's why AYH not. that's why AYH has a white screen. It is not. It's because AYH camera does not work. Oh, well, sure it does. How convenient. This lady has millions of dollars saved up from ripping off American taxpayers and her pension. <laughs> But she can't hey, afford a ten dollar camera. You know, I've heard said, that one before. Listen, <laughs> Cookie, Cookie said heart. last night. Right. I was in Cookie's room last night, and her retirement fund before taxes is a hundred thousand dollars. That's it. Before taxes. Yeah, but that's it. That's a lot. That's what she gets a month. A yes, hundred thousand dollars a month. You're oh, a fucking man. idiot if you believe that. Oh, You're shit. fucking oh. retarded as fuck, right, Pedro? I'm not retarded. You didn't Pedro, where she tell lives. this lady she's retarded. Look, look where she lives. I don't give a fuck if she lives in uh, fucking the United Emirates. Other than that one fucking room that she's been in. Yeah, you because she doesn't want anyone to see her house. She doesn't hey, have Pedro, her. please talk some sense. This Give is one apartment. time where Pedro could tell some truths. Pedro, tell her that some school teacher doesn't make a hundred thousand dollars a month in in pension. What school teachers make fuck all. 
It's her retirement money included. I don't give a fuck. Hey, look, if she saved up every dime and never spent any of her money and put it all in retirement, she still wouldn't get $100,000 a month. Look, someone came into her room last night and said, "I." it's rumored that you make $100,000 a month. She says, well, that is before taxes. Yeah. Well, look, I make $400 million a month before taxes. Yeah, right. That makes it true because I just said it. And also, too, uh, Fucking Cookie, teachers lives, don't make shit. Cookie <laughs> lives in a rent-controlled apartment, so she's paying the same price she paid in the 1980s. Right, so why and, why would some rich person that makes $100,000 a month live in a shitty fucking rent-controlled apartment? Uh, because the people that's living there since then are paying a whole lot more than she is. No, if you make $100,000 a month, you give a fuck all about fucking That's saving $200 a month. No, 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 no. That ain't true. That ain't true, you fucking white trash. Look, a school teacher, retard, a school teacher that normally makes like $30,000 a year, now all of a sudden she makes 100000 a month. How stupid is this story? No, Her, teachers make shit. <laughs> teachers are fucking failure. That, they're, they're a failure in uh, the United States. You know what? They need to pay them way more. They don't pay them fuck all. That's why you got fucking dumb coloreds like this motherfucker talking all this dumb stuff. Like she believes that a teacher makes a hundred grand. Even if you saved every dime that you made the entire life that you worked, you still wouldn't get a hundred grand a month. Okay. Well, it's just, I, I don't know. I'm just telling you. Wow. Let's go back. Let's go back well, to I'm the rent control you, department. You're dumb. you're dumb. There's a lot. There's a lot of apartments in Manhattan that are rent controlled from people who lived there 40 years because now they're charging four or five thousand dollars a month. So that. So so yes, they would live in a rent controlled apartment. Someone that makes a hundred thousand a month would. Well, well. If if you if you if you Google the articles, there's people who have made a million dollars a month. And it's not based on their income. They live in the apartment because they've been there for 40 or 50 years. Yeah, I they, know, but, but if, if, that's but, called look, rent if control. I made a Right, I understand that. But I'm, what I'm saying is rent control is for like old people and social security. No, you're wrong. Old ladies like this lady in a wheelchair. Listen to me. Let me, get, let me continue. What I'm saying is if I made $100,000 a no, month, I wouldn't no, give a fuck about saving. No, how much, no you're I'm wrong. You're wrong. I would give, get a nice property. I you're would wrong. You're wrong. Apartment. There's some apartments in Manhattan that, that people are paying ten, fifteen thousand dollars a month. That there's people who are very wealthy and they're living there because they're cheap and they won't pay more than the nine ninety five that they're paying because it's rent control. Nobody who has money is throwing away their money. They're not giving it away for free. I don't give a fuck how much they make. That's the mistake you make because you don't make any money. So you don't know. Yeah, yeah but look, look, I understand that. <sighs> you know more than me about New York. You know more about uh all that shit that you were just talking about. I understand this. So I'm going to trust you on that. But what I'm saying is, look, Pedro, let's just say for you, for instance, if you were a teacher for 30 years and you lived in this shitty little house that you got with the shitty wires coming out of your TV, and then all of a sudden you made 100000 a month, would you still live in that shitty place just because, oh, well, it's paid off. It's a good deal. No, you can't take it with you. No, you she don't, don't have any kids. She's a loser. She don't have yeah, a husband. Yeah. Some of the wealthiest, some of the wealthiest buildings in Manhattan have rent-controlled apartments. Yeah, but what I'm saying, she has nothing. She has no one to to live on her name. She's not. You're not understanding it. She dies all the money. What are you going to do with the money? Throw it away? Throw it up in the air? Some people, some people will will die with it. They'll they'll give it to their fucking dogs. I'm telling you, that's what Leona Helmsley did. Leona Helmsley died. She left all her money to her dogs. Yeah, she came to our prison too, and yeah, she did leave her money to her dogs. Uh-huh. But, but Joe, for that money. Joe, let me tell you something. Another thing about Cookie, she says she gets gifts all the time. And when she comes through her door, her doorman opens the door for her. She opens her mailbox and she sees a gift. She takes her name off of it and then she throws it away. She does not accept gifts from anyone. However, however she sends gifts to her viewers. Yeah, because she wants your docs. Of course she does. I'll no. get send you a gift right now. AYH, give me your address and your name, and I'll send you a gift right now. That's why I'll send you a gift right now, and I'm never going to accept any gifts from you, so don't bother returning the favor. But give me uh, your address. I say? I've been listening to you for three years. I, all the time. You don't give 
anything to anyone. Why? Have you ever seen me beg for one single solitary dollar? I have not. 